Hello, it is Robotnik is Sexy, and yes, we are in DLC 2 land. I do have uh, the Pokeball Wave, the new haircut. Let's see if I can still get dizzy. Oh, fuck yeah, let's get dizzy. I think they added this in Gen 7. I believe. But anyway, yeah. DLC, whatever. I haven't tried. I haven't tested Wi-Fi yet. I haven't played in a little bit. But I have gone out of my way, of course, to make a good Malamar team. Uh, I'll show you real quick before I whip it online. I just have a filler team right there. Sandy Ogre is kind of perfect. I don't really need to change that. But here we go. TR Singles. Reuniclus. One of my favorites. Let's see. One, two, three. There are at least five favorite Pokemon of mine on this team. Like, fucking seriously. Uh, so, yeah. And man, does Slow King tie it all together. Slow King is OP. You get that chilling reception, and then you uh, bring in Malamar, and then bingo bango, just turns into a sweep, and then you win. Malamar does have knockoff now. Uh, well, again, I should say. He used to have Sucker Punch. They gave Sucker Punch to him once in Gen 7, and then they took it away, they snatched it away, and he's never had it again. Japanese person on the left looking really cool Looking like uh, um, I don't know just a, a cool uh, Trainer dude realistic looking person I guess um, Yeah, let's do it man. You know what it is it is the free-for-all hot ones evil squad. No, no, no TR singles. Yes. Yes. What kind of horrors will I uh, fight here? I want to put it on true random because I think it's really fun when it's random. Because there's so there's so many tracks now with the DLC. Oh shit! Look at this. We might have ourselves a little match here. He has a side bear of his own. Uh. Yeah, it, it doesn't look uh, too bad, really, at all. He has a pretty big uh, fighting weakness. Once I get Trick Room up, I think I just Ice Hammer everybody. Except for Iron Hands, of course. Iron Hands is not going to go down to even Blood Moon, probably. So, how should I do this? Uh, I guess lead Cyber? Cyber seems really good. <clears throat> it is a pretty OP Pokemon, as we all know. And if there's a random team in a free for all that has Mirdon on it, more than likely they are going to pick it as the lead Pokemon. So that's just kind of my thinking. Uh, but man, this team really does. Uh, make me happy, man. Like, it's so crazy. So crazy. So crazy how I didn't hit the done button. <laughs> oh, shit. Okay. Alright. Oh, yes. We get that lovely remix. He's going to leave with this guy. Uh, hmm. I really could have not led with this Pokemon. Because now I might take damage unnecessarily. However, Earth Pyro is looking pretty good. Ooh. Will I just die here? <gasps> Cyber avoids the attack like a beast. Not even super effective, but I will take that all day. That is very unfortunate. I thought about switching into a Psychic-type, 
to potentially resist a fighting hit. Uh, I was thinking Slow King or Reuniclus or something. But yeah, that worked out perfectly. It would have sucked if I switched in Reuniclus on a U-turn though, so... Because Cinderace is a decently threatening Pokemon, I, I think staying into attack is always going to be the best. But well, that's uh, really unfortunate for my opponent here. Let's see if they play out the match. Uh, there he is. Um, hmm. <laughs> I'm just gonna Blood Moon. Oh, he's got his Vacuum Wave. Cool, cool. <laughs> I just <laughs> nuke it with Blood Moon. Let me get a little lefties back. Dang. It did pretty good damage, but yeah, Blood Moon is gonna beat that. I was... <laughs> funny enough, I was thinking, oh man, he'll live this and I can revenge kill with the priority move, but of course, no, that's not needed. Alright, this Pokemon is out. Uh, this is a ghost Pokemon. Um, ghost type does threaten my team, like hella. So, I think I'm gonna call mind in its face and then blood moon again. Okay, I'm just gonna die. That's kind of okay, that's kind of okay. Because blood moon has done so much for me. Alright, it is now gonna be the debut of. LSP Lumpy Space Princess with the Magic Guard Life Orb combo with the Terra Fairy, which I could go Terra Fairy to resist the ghost hit, and I would be killing Mirda and everybody. Let's do it, man. Let's Terra Fairy Trick Room on this guy. There's the cool Pokeball Weave. I also have some crazy shoes. I've got these crazy ghost shoes. I should have shown them off. Well, I guess I did when I spun around, maybe. But, yeah. I um, re-challenged the ghost gym leader and got these really fucking cool ghost shoes. So I can not die to that. Do this. And hell, uh, let's Terra Blast. I think that is game, Zone. I think that's game. This is a pretty rough start, but uh, props to random opponent here for playing it out. Maybe I'm speaking too soon. Maybe he's gonna flip that switch. No. Let's see what that Terra Blast looks like. <laughs> you just make them explode with pink... pinkness. Yeah, the waves of pinkness that slowly explode and kill you. Let's see if I can do it. I am Life Orb boosted. And I have the Terra boost. Oh, oh. You're turning into an electric type now. I wonder how much damage I can do. Yes, here's the electric typing. Let's see, Reuniclus. Ah, uh, it's pretty good damage. Will this knock me out? It will. It will knock me out. I believe Trick Room is still up, so this is kind of okay. Yes, Trick Room did not go down. I think Despair Squid can get a little uh, superpower boost to knock this thing out. Good old Malamar. I have it in the special Dream Pokeball. Two turns left of Trick Room. 
Now, if this doesn't knock out, that would be so fucking embarrassing, but I'm, I'm pretty sure. Oh, goddamn, Malamar, you piece of shit. I'm probably gonna die now. <laughs> uh, I need fling. I need fling. Maybe knockout would have been enough. But yeah. This is not terrible, though. It's not terrible. <laughs> God damn it, I knew it wouldn't kill. Alamar, he needs he needed his terra fighting to knock out, but I already used my terra. But Hat is here. Hat is here and he's he's like, don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. You may have even the score just now by uh, knocking out all those Pokemon, but don't worry about it. I can knock this out and then get up Trick Room again. It should not be a big problem. But uh yes. A little extra spice to the match. A little spicy chili thrown into the stew, so to speak, here. Oh, they're just gonna withdraw. Switching into a psychic is unwise. It's gourmet. You probably drop. No? Not quite. But I can definitely live an attack. With another Trick Room up, it should definitely be a game over now. Unless I get Super Crit? Alright, we do not get Super Crit, so great. We munch on our Citrus Berry. Trick Room up. And yes, this should be fine. Should be more than fine. Let's Drain and Kiss. A little extra health back. A lot of extra health. Almost full. That move heals you so much. It's crazy. It's such a good move. To just knock out a Pokemon. When they have a little bit of health left. And we got a lot of bit of Trick Room left. We have at least three turns to munch on here. Out comes the unkillable monster though. Let's see if it is Assault Vested. Wow. This is really getting quite close. Oh, no. Ooh, critical hit. Another bit of bad luck for my Japanese opponent. Missing high jump kick in the crit. I suppose if, it's, if it was Assault Vested, it would have lived the crit, because that Pokemon is just really crazy. Yes, we can just kiss this thing goodnight. A little goodnight's kiss. Bye-bye. Right on the chest. Right on the neck chest. <laughs> or the, the weird snake neck that this dude has. <laughs> just right there. Okay. That was cool. That was cool. That was way closer than I uh, thought it would be. And again, kudos to random opponent for playing it out and yes there's my awesome trainer card with Malamar who died like a bitch again but we'll try next time we save Terra fighting and then we really get a sweep off I think but yeah good games all right comment like and subscribe I'll see you all later YouTube bye bye